Hello everyone, welcome back to Persona 5 Royal. So, picking up right where we just left off on the last episode, we are leaving Mementos. Oh yeah! Yes, return to the real world. We really didn't get much done based on that list, but hey, I feel accomplished. Hey, hey! Good for her. Yeah. Ah, you're back. Hey, Sergio. Hmm. No pay. Nice going. And yet, boss told us he got paid. He had already been paid, I guess is the correct way to put it. <laughs> Interesting. Well, I do believe it is time okay. to finish off a certain oh. DVD. So I can go get a new one. You're the most unremarkably attractive woman to ever work fashion, Betsy. God, I love you. Yeah, I hear that. Wait, what did you say? <laughs> hmm. Oh. Oh, Mona, that's just because you're hopeful. A little bit of charm. Still quite a ways to level 3, which is crazy when you look at my knowledge unless it's near level 4. Okay. Well then. Friday. This is what she meant by ditch class. What do you want to do? I would like to read the rest of my dog book, please. Murky. Teach me to be smarter. Hey there. Hmm. Let's help okay. you out. Thanks. Oh. 
<sighs> How scary cats can be. Oh, where is this coming from? So... Okay. Stuck in a tree, yep. Tried to rescue it, but it got clawed, yep. Oh, dude. You've never had a pet cat. Oh, you poor summer child. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> well... What are you researching? No, but if I threw medicine at their shadow, would they get better? Hmm. That's a weird thought. Hmm. <laughs> that was incredibly poor acting, Maruki, but that's okay. I get it. Yeah, that's true. But that's the thing, though, is you don't remove the root cause of a pain. You don't look at an arm and go, oh, it's in pain, let me cut it off. You go, oh, it's in pain, how do I repair it such that it's not in pain anymore? And I think that's what you're not grasping, Maruki. Hmm. That's a pretty grand plan. Oh, I did not mean that in a positive way. Well, uh... I can see that. Sounds fun. Oh, sounds great. Rank four. Nice. All right. All right. Happy Be careful. Time. Okay. <laughs> Completely fine. I enjoy the SP increase too. Oh, Maruki, you don't get scammed into handing up your money. Ah, you're back. Play a little. What do we got? What do we got? Label for an unparalleled artist. Oh. My very first thought was a savant, but that's probably something more generic. Probably something like master. Rough drawing is a sketch. Does that fit? Yep. And a 
Dutch painter. Not a clue on that one. Master. Mm. Yeah, I don't know any names of painters. Yeah. Oh well. much rather rent my next CD, DVD, thingy be the ninth, right? Hmm. The sixth. Okay, three more days. I'm glad I checked that. Also need to go visit Iowa. Iowa. No, no. Let's just say the airsoft shop because we're not friends with them yet. And sell the stuff. Hmm. All right. Ooh, sixty thousand dollars. Nice. You should be grateful. I am Welcome incredibly again. grateful. Thank you. Man. Okay. I feel so sorry for you, <laughs> Teach. <laughs> That's my bed you're laying on, you know. Considering I'm pretty sure one of the achievements is the harem ending achievement, I'm gonna have to romance everybody. Sorry in advance. Any money? You know. You don't have a little sister. This was for you. Mm. 
Send me some seriously mixed messages, Kawakami. All right. Ugh. Okay. Yeah, agreed. Okay. Uh, what the hell? Started. Mm, give me a head. See what I was up to? <laughs> up to my rookie. Ah, yes. How about you? I would say the angel effect, but I know it's the halo effect. Right. Why angels are great, so they must be beautiful. Yeah, no, the angels in the Old Testament were horrifying. No way. Nice going. Well, if my character is anything like me, I took horrible notes, and you wouldn't be able to read my handwriting. Says a completely unbiased Mona. Mm. Oh. Okay. <laughs> oh man! <laughs> Seriously, it looks kind of dumb. Just a little bit. Ryuji, where's the good one? I got this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Man. Is that true? Alright, Ryuji, let's go. Hey. Oh, oh, that was a yawn. Let's do it. Wanna get going? Now that's smart, going to a gym to work out rather than your uh, secret places. Mm. This has gotta be it! By the way, Oh, of course I did. Protein powder, right? Gotta get that protein. I mean, I completely agree with you, Ryuji. Wanna get going? And I'm not using yours. <laughs> Slang came from in the first place. Of course, you can do that. Just holding it over your head. Pff, 
for real? That'd be cool. I doubt that. Hmm. Do you want to rejoin them? So he's an asshole? There's a luchador mask on the top of that um, wooden target thing, whose name I forget. Training dummy? Whatever it's called. That's a luchador mask. Why? Why is there a luchador mask on top of the poor training dummy? Oh, okay. Boom. Oh, rank five. Halfway there. Right. See ya. Yeah, Bonkin is not going to catch on, Ryuji. Just give that one up. Don't worry, I got you, man. Setting up a press conference. Okay. The exhibition is finally ending tomorrow. I'm sure things will work out fine this time too. Yeah, me too. You will provide me with calories? What do you mean by that, Kawakami? Okay, you're actually gonna bring food. Alright. Yeah, you, you definitely put a lot of effort into your home cooking there, Kawakami. <laughs> yeah, they do. <laughs> All requests, yeah? as I like. But honestly, I was curious. You called me, so I answered.
I am really worried about you now, Kawakami. Housekeeping. Okay. All right. Good night. You were just here, girl. I mean, she's right. So basically, each of these visits is about 50 bucks uh, American dollars. So, I mean, she she is genuinely right. Sunday. What's up with that old geezer? Is he crying? I... I have committed crimes that are unbecoming of an artist, plainly put. I... Uh, plagiarized work. I... I tainted this... this country's art world and... and even Sayuri. How could I... I possibly apologize to... to everyone for... For what I've done. <laughs> He's crying way too much. <laughs> Heck. And that was from the urgent apology conference by Matarame that took place just a moment ago. After reporting to the association, Matarame has agreed to the police's request to turn himself in. Wasn't he on TV the other day? On top of charges of abuse to his pupils, Matarame is under suspicion of claiming their works as his own. Some doubt the validity that his maiden work, Sayuri, was stolen, believing it was used for fraud. This large-scale criminal act has caused a great shock to the art world, and... That old man's done for. After the conference, Matarame was taken to a police hospital for interrogation due to his age. However, initial psych evaluations state that he is mentally sound and likely responsible for his actions. There's no need to be nice to an old geezer like that. Why'd he spill the beans himself? Doesn't that seem weird? Also, a group calling themselves the Phantom Thieves posted a dubious note at Matarame's exhibit. The police will investigate their relation to this case, but for now, did not identify them as suspects. As suspects in what? The case is about Matarame's fraud. What would they be suspects in? Phantom Thieves? Do these bandits have something to do with that old geezer's apology? Oh, I've heard of them before. They supposedly steal evil hearts. It's why the culprits apologize. Wait, what? Steal hearts? <laughs> That's impossible, though. But I feel like I saw something about that online, too. They sent out a calling card for real. Oh, so it was like, we're going to take your heart? Oh, that's impressive if someone really did that. Phantom thieves, huh? Uh, it says pleasant boy, but that is not a pleasant expression on his face. Hmm. Phantom thieves again. Hey, Makoto. You guys see the news about Matarame? It's just like what happened with Kamoshida. Indeed it is. And they mentioned the Phantom Thieves! Mm-hmm. They did. Man, this is starting to get interesting. If we do it right, we can change people's hearts. With this power, we might be able to do more than just getting back at society. It'll be a big deal. This has already been fun, so I Let's agree. Let's keep pushing on then. As for me, I hope we just keep getting more and more famous. Why? Something like this happening twice is massive, too. It's too great a coincidence to occur normally. If we continue doing this, we'll definitely be able to give courage to everyone who needs it. We may want to quiet down a little. Do you know them? You moron! Those are attendance officers! 
Hello there. May I speak with you for a moment? Ah, uh, yes! How can we help you? That monotonous acting of hers never fails to send a chill down my spine. <laughs> what are you all doing here? Are you friends? We, we wanted some tea. Hmm, is that so? And how would you do that in a place like this? Well, you see, we're standing here planning where to go to get we tea. We were just discussing where we should go. Oh, good on, good on. Well, all right. Just make sure you disperse before it gets too late, okay? There yep. have been some odd happenings lately, and the news about that artist has caused quite the stir. We'll be careful. It's still light out. Man, those guys must have way too much time on their hands. Hey, don't go making stuff up on the spot like that, okay? I totally panicked because of you. <laughs> From now on, we'll need to be even more cautious than before. And maybe not make our hideout somewhere out in the open where people can see us. Look at us. Right after the second thieves incident, both prior victims are meeting up. Wait, you mean people might be listening to us? Yes. It'll be fine. Look around, we're the only people worrying about it. That you can tell. I guess you're right. He's not. By the way, Yusuke, you able to get anything out of Madarame? Remember how he was talking about that suspicious person in the black mask? Yeah, but they don't remember what happens in their palaces, so that's mm, pointless. Well, I pressed him for answers, but he doesn't even understand what happened to him to begin with. It's not like he actually saw his desires get stolen, after all. It's rumored that he may be sent to prison. In that case, gaining information will be difficult. Eh, there's no information to gain. So, what are you gonna do now? I'll be leaving that house. I can't draw on such a place anymore. Do you have somewhere to go? The school dorms. I can stay there free of charge thanks to my fine arts scholarship. Nice. A scholarship? Wait, you're that good? Madarami was literally using his art as professional art pieces and claiming them as his own. Yes, Ryuji, he is that good. Although, Takamaki-san's house would do as well. Ah. Wait, no, it what? won't. <laughs> you know, you could ask her to model for you whenever you wanted. You moron! <laughs> then again, now that Yusuke will be living alone, it'll be easier for us to meet up whenever we want. For the time being, we should wait and see how this case plays out. Agreed. <sighs> and it'll probably take some time finding a target as big as Madarame. Anyway, we should just act like normal students while we look for our next target, okay? We'll be entrusting that to you again, Ryuji. All right. Guess it's just more prep till then. Yep, yep. Yusuke Kitagawa. See, I told you somebody was spying on us, Ryuji. Sai, are you going to spoil the story again? So after Shiho Suzui, you did it again for someone you barely knew? Yep. You were sent away twice, almost reported to the police, and yet you still wanted to save him. Yep. Moreover, you ended up in a museum instead of a castle this time. Yep. You're still going to maintain this rubbish about changing someone's heart by stealing their treasure? Yep. It's the truth. <clears throat> Very well. The truth behind this tale of yours will be clear once your conspirators are in custody. Not gonna happen. Now then, tell me about this new member who joined your group. Oh, he's great. He summons Goemon and he throws ice everywhere. Plus, slashes the crap out of shadows. Oh, he's amazing. There's no point in being stubborn. It will only damage your position. The identity of Madarame's pupil can be easily discovered with a little investigation. Go right ahead. So you won't sell out your accomplice? No. <sighs> Fine. There's still much more that I want to hear. It was around this time that the Phantom Thieves began to truly gain popularity. For some reason. Lies flooded the internet. Things like the Phantom Thieves saved me too, or I got a calling card. 
For heaven's sake, those lies made the collection of intel take almost ten times longer. Now your next target was this man. Junya Kaneshiro. Kaneshiro. He doesn't compare to the previous two. Even the police had been struggling to apprehend him. So, exactly how did you take down such a well-guarded criminal? Tell me. We crashed his flying bank in the sky. Because she definitely believed that. <laughs> The suspect has repeatedly testified that he does not have any recollection of his actions. A full psychiatric evaluation will be performed to further investigate the crime's details and motives. First Kamoshida at Shujin Academy, and now Madarame. I found a number of points of commonality between the two. Both, for example, were sent a calling card before their unforeseen changes of heart. I see. But isn't tying their cases to the series of psychotic breakdowns jumping to conclusions? Yes. Furthermore, the police will frown upon you stepping into this. Now isn't the time to be worrying about things like jurisdiction and honor. Sigh. You're a police officer. You're supposed to always be worried about honor. We need to dig deeper and find a correlation among the incidents these past two, three years. Well, he doesn't want that to happen. Very well, I leave it to you. However, you must not let this interfere with your regular duties. Thank you, sir. That damn woman just had to stick her nose into this. And I understand that these abnormal incidents have caused some anxiety throughout our country. Oh this man, you can tell a bastard just from his voice. With the utmost seriousness. I shall continue to put forth great effort so that every citizen can live with peace of mind. Oh, he sounds so fake. Like an auto-tune machine. Oh. Not only are there these phantom thieves to worry about, but if that is exposed... <sighs> Ping, ping, oh. ping, ping, ping. You're exaggerating. Lounge, darts lounge, yes. <sighs> mm. Yeah. I've never been there. Oh. Let's go. Wait, smoothie, it's Sunday. Smoothie, smoothie. On, oh, fine. Just gonna have to remember to do that before the nighttime event. Whatever it is. Hey! Alright, let's go! Boom! Keiichi Joji! Alright. Oh, I didn't mean to skip you, Mona, I'm sorry. You should be able to buy an expanded pass then. Because, man, you have to go to all these places. You have to. Whoa. Seems interesting. Right? Let's check out everything. Hmm. Uh, hi, Makoto. 
What you up to? Uh, um. Yeah. Um. What manga is that you're reading? I can't. I can't quite. Is that a Persona 2 manga you're reading? That'd be hilarious. Hi there. Hey. Any questions? Yeah. Uh. What's well, up then. here? Four different areas. Promenade. Ground beef cutlets. Retro Street. Jazz <gasps> Club. Uh, please continue. Yes. Oh, no, healing crystal store. Okay. De Chocho. Harmony Alley. Ah, that's fine. What do you recommend? Well, then. And darts and billiards, yeah. Uh, what about somewhere unique? Did you know? The temple on the promenade. Ooh. Um, what about the well, stores? Well, then. Second hand clothing store. <laughs> Sooty. Okay. Anything Actually, else I should know? Sundays they always make more than usual. Nice. I'm good. Come again. Thank you, thank you. What are you? Hmm. Well, take your time. Stay okay, gifts. No interest in gifts. <laughs> Can't go into that store. Okay. Clothing store. Hey. City hmm. clothing. That's a nice amount of money. 300, so that was 34 pieces of clothing I just sold him. Um, let me see your prizes. Adjutant's belt? Clothing grab bag. Sold out. Let me get that just because. Then I'll get one of each of these. Old gassy dress, old, okay. Um, yeah, I'm good. <laughs> then, can I finally, yes. Oh, that's barely better. That's significantly better. Yeah, that's a lot better. And that's quite a bit better. Just four. Poor Mona. Oh. Uh. Uh. Hi again. Still reading the same um. manga? All right. Cool. 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 Oh. Cool. Uh, none of those. Oh, hello. You know, when I first saw this map, I thought that was a car. So I thought this spot was a parking lot. <laughs> hey, look! Hi there! Nice. I see. Oh, the incense hmm. shop. Oh. Hey. For real? Penguin snipers. 
Hmm. Electrician. Oh, is this the healing crystal shop? Come on. A couple more places to check. I see. Imported grocery. Does this have? In. No, it doesn't. I was seeing if it had imported protein. Because <laughs> that's apparently the good stuff. Jazz oh. club. Okay, let's do our first game of Billy Bowls. Whoa! Hmm. Yep, let's go. Alright, so I don't... Don't really remember how to play this little mini-game. Alright, Bull! That's a new high score! The center of the target's called the Bullseye. If you land a dart there, it's called the Bull. I know because I looked up the rules online last night. <laughs> anyway, this game's called Zero One. You win by getting your score all the way down to zero points before the other player. Oh, so you're not trying to get a high score, but get rid of your score? That's pretty different. We both start with the same score. Then you lose points based on the number on the board where your dart lands. And you can only win if you get your score down to zero exactly. You can't even be off by a single point. How's that sound? Pretty sick, right? Indeed. So you have to be able to calculate your score properly while making sure you hit the right numbers on the board. This game seems like it takes a lot of concentration. <laughs> One point? Come on. You have to straighten your arm out more and... Hey, Ryuji, what's up? Ah, I was just reading this flyer. It says, darts is a party when you play in pairs. You team up with someone and alternate throwers when it's your turn. You still use the same rules I told you, though. Hey, what do you say we give it a try? I'm good with that. Hell yeah! That's what I'm talking about. Let's do this. Whoa, a bull right off the bat? Man, talk about an exciting opening. Here goes. Don't underestimate an ex-athlete. Remember, Ryuji, we're trying to get to zero. Hell yeah, triple 20. Whoa, he hit such a tiny spot. Quite impressive, especially for you, Ryuji. We're almost down to zero points. Let's really focus for this last round. Do I get to play it? Oh, I do. Oh, no, I don't. Zero points right on the dot. Oh, ain't we badass? That's no easy feat. You really do have something special going on. Man, this is so fun. When you're on the line, the pressure's insane. But it makes you want to do your best for your partner. Damage up and HP recovery when baton passing. Nice. Oh, and mine went up. Cool. Cover SP, yes. <laughs> Based on the looks on your faces, I'm guessing both of you got something out of this game. Even if it is just a game, it can be some kind of training, depending on how you play. That's a good way to look at it. <laughs> well, I do always have the Phantom Thieves on the brain. Let's keep practicing together here. Uh, oh, let's invite everybody next time. I don't think everybody Man, can hit. All this just from me asking you to meet me here? This is like, uh, you know, one of those strikes of good luck. Serendipity? A stroke of good luck. Why would it be a strike? Who would protest having good luck? Ooh, what's that? Billiards. Oh, yeah, they have pool here, too. Hmm. This game could be useful, too, depending on how we look at it. Yeah, it's already pretty late, though. We can come back and play it later. Ah, and don't forget, 
We got a couple free tickets to play today, but next time you'll have to pay up. But it was super fun, right? Oh, I really want to play again sometime. Well, we should head home for the day. Thanks for hanging out. I'd be saying the same thing if you had let me play the game. Hmm. I really wasn't expecting them to take that away. I thought that was going to be the introduction to the mini game. Hey. to rage and the cops oh he's senile gotcha hmm. harmony alley okay uh speech today yeah i actually would but i'm going to go get my smoothie first why I'm a glutton for punishment. All right. Uh, let's harden our hearts. Welcome. The beauty blended with collagen, so it's nice and thick on the way down. more points. Oh, 12 more points. Alright. Yoshida! I am so down for a speech today, man. Yep, go right away. Everyone. Good evening. Yep. Right away, then. Everyone. You. I want to improve my speech. <laughs> One with conviction. You gotta have a strong conviction. Diplomacy. Occasionally ask for more money or items during negotiations. Nice. All right. You know what that really unlocks, though? What that unlocks is you get money guaranteed the first time, and then you can press Y and kill them for all the money and experience you would have got anyways. <laughs> That's what that really unlocks. That is, in fact, false. Mm, charm is starting to get up there. I shall ask you again another time. Changed my whole outlook. Oh, you are another one who doesn't understand sarcasm. We were talking about being firm on our beliefs. And you, ex okay. All right, cool beans, man. Cool beans. <laughs> Monday. Did you see the news about the calling card? Is written. Have people really stolen hearts? 
I can't believe they exist. Interesting. <sighs> ah, poor Mona. <laughs> There's a very different reason why they were checking you out, Ryuji. Something strange. For real? We don't do black, no, we just beat the crap out of them. How are things going in regard to that matter we spoke of earlier? Slow. I have nothing to report yet. Nothing at all? How many students are there who could provoke a teacher? I've already narrowed it down. I just can't get any solid evidence. You knew, didn't you? About Mr. Kamashita sexually harassing students. Mm. Sir! What will come of you asking that? This investigation is for a just cause, correct? Nope. I believe I understand how flustered this must be making you. I'm sure it was truly shocking for you as student council president to see a peer attempt suicide. Yes. We must provide a school environment where all students can feel at ease. That is the most pressing issue we have to tackle at the moment. So that's your reason behind this investigation on the Phantom Thieves of Hearts? We don't even know if they truly exist. Why are you... You heard about the incident with that Madarame fellow, I assume? They said there was a similar calling card to the one used in Mr. Komashita's case. Oh, but the art on the back was completely different. There's no way they're related. I wish to believe that this is unrelated to our students. Yes. That is where I stand. I suggest you devote your energy to the task at hand, not unnecessary questions. <sighs> Eggman be pushing it. Did you see Madarame's press conference? You mean that guy oh, wow. who was all like, how could I possibly apologize for what I've done? <laughs> they have him drawn on the blackboard, bawling his eyes out. Wow, okay. Think it was really those phantom thieves? You know, the whole stealing your heart thing? Yes, it that? was. Uh, there's no way. But then again, it seems too convenient for it all to just be coincidence. Ah, uh, maybe he's going senile. She yeah. is an old man. Have you found our next big target? No, but Sai did give me a pretty big clue on who it's gonna be. I just started looking yesterday. No way I'm gonna find one that quick. Oh yeah, I guess that's true. By the way, I decided on the TV station. What about you two? Huh? For what? Oh crap, the social studies trip. Oh, I just wanna ditch it. <laughs> yeah, I don't think you can, Ryuji. You'd better go to your school activities. Didn't I tell you not to draw attention to yourselves? Wouldn't me suddenly turn it into a good student stand out more? No. Quit bickering and go. Then let's all choose the TV station. Agreed. Good I choice, Anne. get to watch them tape a show. Maybe there'll be actresses there. Not that type of show. Oh, well. Not like I got anything better to do than waiting for info to come in online. Plus, Morgana's right. Showing up will keep the teachers from getting all suspicious of me. All right, I'm gonna head back. TV, huh? Maybe I should get a haircut. Your hair is getting pretty shaggy, man. That guy is such an idiot. I hope nothing happens. Oh, I have no room to talk. My character's hair is so shaggy, she needs a hairbrush. 
Oh my. Okay. to the forehead. Ow. Pay attention. <sighs> that sounded painful too, that crack. Senpai. What a pleasant surprise. Hey, Sumi. It's really pouring down, isn't it? It is. Let me guess you forgot your umbrella too. I thought something like this would happen. So I snuck a collapsible umbrella into your bag. Oh, Magrana, you're a genius. Well, you do carry me around in your bag all the time. I've got to show my appreciation somehow. Well, see you around. Where's your umbrella? Unfortunately, I forgot it. Use but mine. But it's fine. I'll barely get wet if I run. If anything, it'll make for good training. Nope. You, you want a piece of this? <laughs> oh, you'll share your umbrella? <laughs> you want a piece of this? <laughs> That'd be wonderful. Thank you uh, so much. And what are all those umbrellas in that stand there for? Ah, what ifs, what ifs, what ifs, what ifs. <sighs> Thanks again for letting me join you. Man, I am not holding that umbrella very steady, am I? To be honest, prelims are coming up soon, so I didn't want to take any chances of getting sick. Gymnastics? Yeah, that's right. Two huge competitions are coming up. One at the beginning of summer, and one near the end. If I'm going to participate in the prelims, I have to be selected as my club's representative. And there's a qualifier meet to determine who that rep will be. It's my dream to compete in gymnastics on the global level. So, I plan on maintaining a strict training regimen with my coach. You sure are devoted, but you know what? I'll cheer you on. I'd be invincible if I had you cheering me on, senpai. <laughs> oh, we're already at the station. I'll be fine from here out. I can't thank you enough for today. I swear, I'll return the favor some... Hey, isn't that Yoshizawa? You mean the honors gymnast? She gets the VIP treatment at school and a boyfriend to escort her around? Miss Special Snowflake sure is living on Easy Street. Ah, assumptions, assumptions. Grass I'm is sorry. always greener, right? You shouldn't have to deal with a misunderstanding like that. Nah, it's fine, Sumi. Don't worry about it. Yeah, you're right. The same thing happens in class, too. People are often wary of me because I'm an honor student. The school's expecting me to attain strong results in the upcoming competitions, too. That's a lot of pressure. They even told me I didn't have to participate in the cleanup event. But I just don't like getting special treatment. Oh, excuse me. My father's calling. Hello, Dad? What was that? Uh, sorry, my phone's been acting up lately. It's okay. Thanks. Mm-hmm. I'll see you later. Sorry about that. He asked if I needed a ride since it's raining. A bit overprotective, don't you think? Nah, he just sounds like a good father. You got a great dad. Yes, I definitely agree. Well, I have to get to practice, so it's time for me to go. Definitely better Thanks than so my parents. Today. Like... Think about it. Th this character we're playing as parents. Don't contact him once in an entire year of him being away from them. Not once. Not a letter. Not a phone call. Nothing. No contact for a year. And then he just up and goes back to them. Yeah, that sounds like bad parents to me. <sighs> Excuse me. Bye, Sumi.
seems pretty rough. Yeah. Aoyama Ichome. This is Aoyama Ichome. Train doors are now closing. Please stand back. That is horrible speculation, Mishima. Don't go there. Hey, hey! No, no, that's that's not what he's talking about. He's talking about sadism, masochism. All right, guys, I am gonna save it here and drop this episode like it's a hot tamale, because I've been sitting in this chair for about two and a half hours and my butt is killing me. Still, I've had fun. I hope you all had fun, and I hope. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.